I'm Jolie Sully in Belgrade where residents say they have wanted an aquatic center in town for years now. And because the city has grown so much, that wish is finally being granted. But the only question is where to put it and how to pay for it. It's winter nine months out of the year. Um, it would be great for everybody. I mean, we love going to the water. Kayla Watson has lived in Belgrade for three years with her two-year-old daughter, Adeline, who she says loves to be active. We come to the splash pad, actually, right there. But when the splash pad closes, Watson and her daughter have to travel to the Bogart Pool in Bozeman or the Chico Hot Springs to swim. This problem might be solved for Watson soon. We're really working on developing a parks and recreation district for the city. Neil Cardwell, the city manager for Belgrade, says building an aquatic center in town is the driving force for the project. This has been going on for about 20 years with different various groups trying to get a pool in Belgrade. He says due to population growth in town, they are now able to support a project like this, but... One of the biggest issues is where do we put it? Cardwell says they have their eye on this 80-acre lot of land owned by the state. He says the good news is no one has bid on it, but the bad news is that the state can't hold it for them. The asking price is $65,000 an acre. We know from an aquatic center standpoint what we think that that would cost for the taxpayers of the Belgrade High School District boundaries because that's what we're proposing. About $50 million to construct it and acquire the land. That equates to about $15 to $20 a month for the average homeowner. He says the next step is seeking input from the public within the next month. No, just a, a place for somebody that has disabilities so they can go too. Definitely a safe walking trail um, and then uh, affordable prices. In Belgrade, Jolie Salee, MTN News.